this is Matt. Um, I am a member on eBay, Matty Martin 87 and this is a quick demo of the MacBook that I have for sale. It is a white Intel Core 2 Duo, 2.4 gigahertz. Um, it has a NVIDIA 3, 320M uh, or something like that. Um, all the specs are listed on eBay. Um, and for those of you on YouTube, you can uh, click the link below and um, and then go right to the auction, which ends in two days. So, um, so as you can see, this is the outside of it, the top, very shiny. Um, it's uh, really been taken care of. And um, it's been my personal computer. I've been using a Henge dock um, as a desktop replacement. So um, the I.O., as you can see here, I don't know if I can zoom in. Forgive me, never made a YouTube video. So, okay. Uh, yep, pretty interesting. <laughs> okay, so that's that. And then, uh, oh, also it has a... Uh, uh, DVD and writable and CD writable drive slot loading um, working fantastic um, multi touch trackpad and um, also has Mavericks loaded onto it. This computer is a little bit special because it's been upgraded. I have put in a one terabyte uh, 7200 RPM uh, hard drive, it's Toshiba, and also. Uh, what else? Oh, I put in the 12 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM, which um, if you look on Apple's website, it says it's only rated for eight, but OWC, um, Other World Computing, has rated this um, max of 16 gigs. So it still has some room. I have 12 gigabytes, one eight gigabyte stick, and one uh, eight gigabyte, and one four gigabyte from OWC. So um, let me show you. There's pretty good condition. The only, uh, like thing that's notable, I guess, is this. I tried to take a picture of it, but it's like a little, I don't know if you can see that right there. It's like a little mark. Um, it's just from the closing and opening of the thing. I mean, this thing is from 2010, so it's not like brand new. It's like three years old, about four years old, but anyways, um, I mean, it's, it's white. It's not discolored. Um, I had a question from an EVM member on that. Uh, is this a you know, is it yellowing or anything? No. Um, and those other ones that are on eBay are pretty gross. Uh, I don't know if anybody takes care of their stuff. So, and uh, we're going to turn, gonna turn this on, I guess. And I don't know if you can even see the button. It's like it's white. Okay, well, anyways, so. You know, and we have 10.9 Mavericks on here. So um, I upgraded it from the mountain lion that was on it before. Um, the thing about Mavericks is that it, uh, like, when you start it up, like, all the programs, like, you have to kind of, like, wait for it to kind of, you know, be open and on. Like, I would say that the best performance is when um, you've had all your apps, like, you know, you've opened them and then closed them and opened them back up. It just, they run a lot better. The only upgrade that I think I would do, um, that I never really got to is putting a, um, SSD, a solid state drive into it. So that is, it's pretty much the only thing I would do. Yeah, I have eTorrent, so don't judge. Anyways, uh. What do we have in here? So I wanted to show you the memory um, in here. So we'll go to about this Mac, just to show you here. It is 12 gigabytes of DDR3. And I'm gonna open up the profiler. So we have NVIDIA 320 um, Mavericks. And we have a one terabyte hard drive. And here is the memory, one eight gigabyte and one four gigabyte. So like I said, it goes up to 16. So it's pretty, pretty decent. I've been doing a lot of my work on it. Um, and uh, had really no issues to speak of. So as far as apps preloaded on it, um, we have uh, all your normal ones. I put on Photoshop 
Illustrator and uh, I work in the iLife suite. So um, any uh, regular or even you know seasoned user would be pretty pretty happy with just just some basic apps. I, f I figure I mean you know Macs don't usually put anything on them, so you don't have to pay for it. So I thought I'd put it on there for you. I've been using it myself. So um, internet's pretty speedy. Loads right up. I'm just trying to give you a little demo to see how. I mean, the speed really, the memory does actually help a lot. I mean, it, I mean, for being a 2010 and Intel Core 2 Duo, it actually makes, uh, well, I just showed you my location, but oh well. Please don't come find me. Anyway, so quit. Quit. Uh, here's iTunes, which is usually always slow, but, um, I mean, you know, it, it takes up a lot of, like, memory because iTunes is no longer just for music anymore. That's me complaining. Um, we have iWork. Here's Pages. As you can see, everything loads up pretty fast. Like, it's, it really is um, a really great system, um, you know, to do some moderate work on. Um, you know, I don't know if I would do like, you know, Final Cut Pro uh, editing on it all the time. Um, but just for simple things, like even iMovie, I mean, you can see it. Uh, the memory does make this computer an actual viable option, um, you know, for for pretty much anything. And uh, I can show you a keynote. I mean, I don't know. I'm trying to find some, you know, oh, well, let's just show you Photoshop too, because that's, you know, it can be taxing on an older system like this, but actually it runs pretty good. So I will, uh, let's see here, Photoshop. And it's CS6, so, and it starts up pretty fast. And I don't know if you know the Mavericks, like it, uh, if you haven't used it before, but it always uh, loads real slow when you first open up the program after a startup. But then when you load it again, why do I keep doing that? When you load it again, it just kind of pops up even faster. And it just kind of saves the memory, um, saves it onto the memory. Um, here's Illustrator. Trying to give me an indication of the speed of this uh, system. It's, it's pretty good. I mean, like I said, it's a lot of bang for your buck. And another thing too, it's white, so pretty cool. I mean, you know, Mac doesn't make anything white anymore. It's pretty sad. It's my favorite color. So, um, that's about it. I just wanted to show you a quick uh, app uh, demo. Um, show you that. Yes, it does have 12 gigabytes of RAM. And uh, yes, it is operational and it does work. So, um, also FaceTime camera. Yeah, you're going to see me here. Probably not a very attractive view here. Hey! <laughs> so, uh, that's enough of that. <laughs> okay. So the camera works. Um, oh, iPhoto. Pretty good. Pretty speedy. No photos in it, but... Um, okay. So, yes, it comes with a charger. And um, it is pretty portable. Uh, as far as as far as that goes i mean it's not like you know a macbook air by any means also here's the bottom it's in very good shape there's no uh no peeling no discoloring like on the other ones on ebay that are going for about the same price as this uh for starting a, for starting bid anyways um i mean usually a system like this would uh i mean i think they have some on there that start at 800 for an eight gigabytes of ram and one terabyte hard drive so you get more memory better condition and um, and some apps as well. So it's a very speedy machine, love it. Um, I just need to move to an actual desktop, um, Mac Pro, so should be coming soon. But in the meantime, uh, this is what you get. With it, you get that, here's the shipping box by the way, I'm reusing, um, so, but it will be shipped very nicely, very uh, safely, waterproof, Lee. Here is the hinge dock uh, in the box. Box that will come with the box of all the cables that it came with. It's basically new. 
Um, and all this really, it does not come with that little uh, memory, this thing right here. It does not come with that. Uh, I bought that on eBay, $10. So, um, but that's the Henge Dock. Uh, basically, uh, it's, it's made for this computer. And as you can see in the picture, you just pop it in and you have an instant desktop solution. So, and yes, it does mirror on um, screens pretty well. Let me show you here. There's a mini display port, just like so. And what do we have here? We have USB. Just like so. And this is, uh, I got this here from, uh, well, I think I got this display from macofalltrades.com, but it's pretty awesome. Um, it makes it, you know, it changes resolution uh, once you go into clamshell mode, just like so. So, and basically that's what the hedge dock does, but it makes it so you don't have to keep plugging and unplugging all your devices and have it sitting on your desk. So, um, but yeah, pretty awesome. Uh, it's for sale right now, starting bid six forty nine. So pretty good price to start out at, considering the other options that are available online. So I hope I can. It gives you a pretty good overview. Um, it's in very good shape. Try to take care of it as much as I can. I mean, there's little, you know, vanity, like you know, scratches like that one, and I mean, I think there's like a couple other things. You check out the pictures on eBay, but um, nothing major, and it really does show nice. Battery is really good on it, so. Lasts about uh, four and change. Um, I'm gonna barely take it off this, so I think I've taken it off maybe about five or six times. And yes, it is coffee shop worthy. So, um, and I think that is about it. Uh, if you like uh, this MacBook, please uh, place a bid and um, happy bidding. Thanks.